need the milk, and then we have to sieve here. The milk calm down, and then we cook with the milk, like a t a m k a d o This is you're making, you're making coconut milk here, and this is grated coconut. And he is squeezing it, and pretty soon he's going to put it into this uh, this uh, press over here, grater, uh, uh, with a, a bowl with holes in it, basically, and squeeze the coconut milk out. And do you add water to this? Yeah, you add the water, and then squeeze it, and the coconut milk comes out. So he's squeezing the coconut by hand, and then when he squeezes the milk out and leaves the milk, then he puts the dried coconut here. And it's going to be used to make curry for this chicken. It fried for snack or to yeah. The chicken is fried to to get the fat out of the skin, and then it's going to be baked. Is that correct? You're going to cook it again, and this will be chicken curry. And then is the k a i k u r i It's a curry that we bought yesterday. Then t h e s for Muslim. Okay. People do it. The Muslim people it. make this this special curry here. Yes, then we cook with the milk. Uh huh. With the coconut I mean, milk or milk, the cocoa milk. Oh, oh, sm oh, mash the mash the coconut out. Uh -huh. So he's going to take this coconut and put it in no, here. No, 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 no. Go throw away. Oh, out this is it. all done. He's going to throw that out. We 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 only get the milk. He's making use, the milk here, it. and then he's going to strain it. We over use here. the milk. And then you're going to mix it in with this with curry Jimmy, paste, curry pa paste, which you bought at the market. Yes. Muslim people make this. We can do this. it. God is a special special recipe. Muslim, Muslim, huh? Muslim uh -huh. people can do it. Muslim Because people make that this, this kind of curry. Uh, this, uh, dish, this dish is uh, made uh, from uh, Muslim people, huh? It's not this is a, this is a Muslim dish we're making yes. here, right here. The, the uh, uh, Chicken curry, kai yes, curry, yes. kai curry. Yeah, chicken kai curry. It's actually a Muslim dish. Yeah. We strained it already yeah. through this. Now we're we're just straining it to this fine uh, a fine strainer here. Uh. And this coconut milk is going to be used in your your curry dish, yellow curry. And here is a completed uh, project. Coconut milk. It's about a liter. Or so. This I use. I cook with a curry, and the second one I will cook with a, a chicken. Huh? Uh huh. I use two, 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 three, three. Uh, uh, maybe three times, maybe four times, right? Yeah. But for for us, we cook. We want to do the best one, nah? That's why we we use only two times. Yeah. This is the same coconut that's already been squeezed, and now they've added more hot water to it, and they're going to squeeze it a second time. And she's saying that. Uh, The best coconut milk is squeezed twice, maybe. Uh, after three or four times, it's not as good quality. Eventually, they're going to have to throw all of the, the coconut, grated coconut, out. So he's added hot water again. The hot water loosens the coconut fat and helps it dissolve out. Uh, now they just add a little bit of, of salt to it, a little bit of rock salt, and. Uh, He's he's just stirring it around here for a moment, and then he's going to start squeezing it again, and uh, then running it through the, the the strainers. But this will probably be the last time because they they want they said they want high quality coconut milk, and you only hand squeeze it maybe twice uh, uh, before the quality goes down.
the coconut doesn't go to waste. As you can see, this is the coconut from the coconut milk. It's now been used as compost out in the garden. Uh, here in Thailand, we have we can buy fresh, fresh, uh, fresh uh, cocos now. Yeah, fresh yeah. coconut. Yeah. It doesn't. It only grows in the tropical countries. Mm -hmm. it doesn't it doesn't grow in mm -hmm. much of the world. And then it's actually very thick, just the way it was made, and it's going right into your walk. When we curry. buy now, we, do, we we ne we will never know. What the people put it is the maybe the powder, but, but when yeah. we do it by ourselves, we will get a poor, no? Yeah, you know exactly what's in it when you make it yourself. Uh -huh. So now you're going to add the, you bought this at the, the market and you said it's made by Muslim people who are, uh, who make, then we can, uh, we can, make this, we can it's like a secret recipe. Uh -huh. The, uh, the secret uh, recipe now by yeah. by Muslim na, people now. Uh -huh. We are Thai people. We cannot do it. It's uh, for ten ten pieces of chicken. Maybe use a uh, uh, hundred fifty gram na. Hundred fifty grams of this for ten pieces of chicken. No. And we put more than more uh, spicy na. Or yellow curry. Mm -hmm. that, that's why we say curry. Add some pepper to curry. make it spicy. Some peppers. Yellow curry, no? that's original for English. Yeah. Then Muslim uh, eat eat uh, like uh, the dish. Uh, if we eat uh, like in, uh, English people, no? Uh huh. And then we have to put slowly. Gas, nah. Yeah. Yeah, nah. Then nah. you heat it slowly. Yeah, you heat it uh, slow. Meanwhile, outside, the chicken is cooking in a big pot with some onions on top of a charcoal fire, and it's it's boiling. It's in some water. Yeah, this is just barely yeah. simmering, really. Yeah. And, and you're gradually pour, adding and a little more coconut pour. milk around the edges like that. We've got potatoes over here. Yes, the potatoes. Cooked. They're already done. They're already done. And the chicken is boiling. I thought it was boiling in water, but you said it's boiling in the second pressing of the mm -hmm. coconut milk. Mm -hmm. This yeah. is the first pressing he made of the coconut milk. The second pressing. They just add it right to the pot and put the chicken in, and that's what the chicken is boiling in on the fire and outside. Because the chicken has to be, how do you say, not soft, how do you say, the... Um, uh, uh, cook. Cook for soft. Oh, you it say? has to be cooked until it's well, very well done, soft. Well done, well, well done, done, yeah. well done yes. It looks very good. It really smells good, too. Yeah, and then you yeah every few minutes you're adding more of this coconut milk. Smell curry, no? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Smells like curry in here. It's amazing how thick you got the milk. Just he squeezed it by his hands. <laughs> how thick you got it. It looks like milk, uh, cow's milk. Yes. Actually. Yes. And that he just squeezed that with his hands. And, uh, but this, as you said, is the, the first pressing, the first squeezing, I should say. I mean, the fresh, fresh uh, coconut juice, no? then uh, yeah. more, delici more delicious, no? You're right. More, more delicious. More, more. Nothing like fresh coconut uh, milk to make the curry taste it at its best. Because when we, when we buy uh, the packet one, no? Maybe they put in, uh, I don't know, how for, for to keep longer. Nah? Yeah, they put preservatives yes, in yes. if you buy it uh, in a package. It's easy. It's easier to do this that way. Just buy a container now. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um, 
but this is when you have a big party or something and a lot of chicken and you want the best for everybody but, but you, you you buy the coconut and you squeeze the coconut yourself you have to you have to have a time now much time now yeah yes. it's going to take you all day yeah then this is uh food to do when we have we are many people and then we have time now yeah. then then take a time the the dish will more delicious no? yeah okay we took the curry and now we're adding it to the stock pot with the chicken. Don't ask me how much it was. He, he was kind of an estimate. Looked like about a, a quart of curry sauce. Smells really good. Smells like curry. How long are you going to boil that for? Or just let it sit? Maybe an hour. No? Okay, so it's going to... Because we use uh, the coal, the charcoal. Yeah, no? it's being uh, charcoal, cooked with charcoal. Okay, so we're going to add the uh, potatoes now. Cook it for an hour. Okay. Is that about uh, three or four potatoes? I think, I, oh, I cut them. I think there's about four potatoes there. And they added uh, some onion earlier. Uh, the onion is cooking with the chicken. It's probably about two onions. Chicken and a coconut milk. That boy was boiling here. Smell, smell smells good, like huh? curry, yeah. Smells great. And 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 uh, and keep and cook together, no, not 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 like a uh, 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 how do you say uh, hurry hurry now with the gas. Yeah. But here slowly slowly up. When you're cooking with charcoal, you, uh -huh. you it's cooking almost just simmering, mm -hmm. cooking very slowly. But you you. You, when you cook or oh, with the, uh, the, uh, the gas, nah? only. Yeah. Mm. Gas stove is for hurry, high hurry, heat. Hurry, hurry, hurry up nah? and cook. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Oh, then seal it. <laughs> right. This is an all day kind of job mm. right here. Kind of fast. It's going to sit oh. and simmer for a long time. Mm. And this is some fish sauce. Mm. So we added the uh, potatoes and we added uh, some pepper and uh, red pepper and some fish sauce. Now, and, uh, test, uh, do a taste yeah, test. Uh, do a taste uh, for maybe some more. And she's gonna she's gonna add some uh, sugar. some sugar. sugar. Is this brown sugar? She's adding some brown sugar to it. This is chopped uh, pumpkin, a Thai pumpkin, about a, one quarter of a pumpkin. And this is coconut milk. The rest of the milk that uh, we used earlier to make curry, this is the leftover. And this is palm sugar. It's kind of a thick liquid. And we're going to make a dessert out of this Thai dessert. Okay, we're putting some sugar. 
and about a quarter of water. Brown sugar. Now we're going to add some palm sugar. Kind of a thick paste, almost like peanut butter, is what it looks like. Sugar. And next thing we're going to add, there's some coconut milk over here. Oh, okay. We'll wait for the sugar to melt. In goes the coconut milk. So that was it. Here it's starting to boil. It's roughly about a liter of water, a liter, or excuse me, a half liter of water, a half liter of coconut milk, and about a quarter cup of palm sugar, and uh, perhaps uh, half that much regular sugar, or actually it was brown sugar. And we're just waiting for it to, to boil here, and we'll add the pumpkin. Okay, in goes the pumpkin. And we'll let it cook for a few minutes. Okay, right from the garden. Not sure what herb this is. Several leaves. Let's try to find out. What is the name in Thai of that? Bai Toi. Bai Toi. Okay. Uh, it's been boiling for about 10 minutes, so we just we check, <laughs> checking it right now. Added a little water. We'll check it again in a few minutes. But here's the final product. It's been cooked for about 15 minutes until the pumpkin is soft. Ready to be put into bowls and eaten. Here's an interesting, an interesting uh, variety of, of fish. Uh, this is a uh, barbecuing. It's not fresh fish. This fish has been uh, set out in the sun for an entire day, dried in the sunlight. And uh, it's dried and it's actually several days old. But it's still good. You can cook it like this over a charcoal fire. Okay, so this is basically dried in the sun fish. It was set out, dried all day in the sun, and then put on a barbecue. I think that was a fin I just ate. Actually, it tastes pretty good. Fish jerky, maybe.